A very important verse for both of us is Ephesians 2.10, for we are God's workmanship created in Christ Jesus to do good works. The word workmanship, the original New Testament Greek is actually poema, which could be translated as workmanship, work of art, poem, or masterpiece. Years ago, God has given us this calling that every single young person we come across, they are truly God's masterpiece. So whether we have one semester or a few years with a student, it is truly a privilege to journey with them. So we see that very holistically. I'm not just a faculty here teaching. Every morning I look at the list of students and I, I try to pray for each one. I made it a habit that the first day of class, I would learn the name and I would call them by their first name. <laughs> At a small classroom size, I can actually help students learn and appreciate chemistry. The courses, they are rigorous, and the reason why they're rigorous is we know that they can make a very big impact. The difference is that we want them to be successful. We're giving them the tools to have difficult discussion about science and faith, and also what does all this mean. I really believe that there's a book of nature and a book of scripture, and they have one author, and that is God as we learn and teach science, it is really about understanding nature, the world around us. And since it's the same author, it is easy to point to students the wisdom, the truths are from him. Every semester we have students over, we call it Cafe Huang, just to take a break from their studying, have a home cooked meal. And we ask questions, what has God been doing in your life? Because we believe that God is always doing something in their lives and just to experience God even more. It's very, very fun to see them. I feel very fortunate that I don't have to compartmentalize my life. I can be myself at home, at work, at church. It's the same Louise who love students, who love helping others understand chemistry can be fun and that God loves them.